Would anyone spend more than $28 million on a car just to get that luxurious car with a boot that resembles a boat tail? Even if it is stacked with some of the most expensive drinks and an independent setup perfect for a romantic outing? Well, it's a Rolls Royce for crying out loud. In 2017, the Rolls Royce swept tail was reportedly considered the most expensive car in the world. Now, the boat tail has taken its place with an estimated price tag of $28 million. Rolls-Royce said the boat tail was commissioned at the request of a successful couple whose brief was, show me something that I have never seen before. The car styling takes inspiration from its J-Class yachts and classic boat tail Rolls-Royce cars, which were created when coach builders attached the hull forms of sailing boats onto RR chassis in the 20s and 30s. The bodywork of the Rolls-Royce boat tail is made 100% by hand. The outside is wrapped in a peculiar shade of blue, the customer's favorite color. In the shade, the color is subtle and retro, but in the sunlight, the metallic and glass flakes embedded in the paint provide a bright and energetic aura to the finish. Measuring just under 5.8 meters long, the new four-seater two-door Rolls-Royce boat tail is the first to be built by Rolls-Royce's new coach-built department at the company's boutique headquarters in Goodwood, Sussex. The most striking features of this sumptuous vehicle are in the trunk. Opening the trunk at an angle of 15 degrees, the perfect measure according to the British, unfolds an umbrella and a set of accessories for a stylish picnic. These include folding chairs, glasses, and a pair of bespoke coolers, which hold bottles of Armand de Brunac Champagne, one of the world's most exclusive beverages. In the glove compartment, there's a uniquely designed Mont Blanc pen, as well as an interior expressly made to house an exclusive Beauvais 1822 watch, the cost of which can reach several thousand and even millions of euros. Refrigerators are designed to maintain a temperature of 6 degrees Celsius, the recommended temperature for serving this drink. Rolls-Royce's new coach-built arm has been set up specifically to capitalize on the growing number of similar, super-rich customers who want a luxury limousine that they can help to create and is unique to them. The project took four years to develop, a virtual model was digitally mastered to form a frame in which the aluminum sheets are manually forged. While finalizing the designs with clients, the brand's aluminum chassis, luxurious architecture, was entirely reconfigured to support the generous proportions of the boat tail, a process that took eight months. Boat Tail is the culmination of collaboration, ambition, effort, and time. It was born out of a desire to celebrate success and create a legacy. In its remarkable accomplishment, Rolls-Royce Boat Tail forges a pivotal moment in the history of our brand and in the contemporary luxury landscape, said Torsten Muller, Otvoss, CEO of Rolls-Royce. Although the boat tail is based on the Phantom's platform and shares that car's 6.75-liter V12, almost every element is new, with 1,813 completely new parts developed for the car, including every body panel. Even the 15-speaker sound system was redesigned to make sure it was optimized for the open-top body. The color of the car's paint is also unique, developed to match the owner's favorite shade of blue, and reflect the car's nautical links. In a first for Rolls-Royce, the bonnet features graduated shading which is reflected in the different colored upholstery between the front and rear seats. With its wraparound high windscreen and dipping tail, the four-seat convertible is coach-built, meaning its chassis, engine, and underpinnings are modeled on the existing Rolls-Royce Phantom. Every other design feature is one of a kind, ranging from Rolls-Royce's largest ever panels to the pen holder, every element is handmade and boasts mind-boggling attention to detail. The most eye-catching features center around the boat tail's aft deck, a modern interpretation of a yacht's wooden rear deck in a special gray and black Cali de Legno wood veneer that is visually elongated using brushed stainless steel pinstripe inlays. At the press of a button, this rear deck opens up like sweeping butterfly wings to reveal an intricate hosting suite. For alfresco entertaining and displaying a treasure chest of moving parts, Alex Eins, head of Rolls-Royce coach build design, commented, Coach build provides freedom to move beyond the usual constraints. Normally, there's a natural ceiling to Rolls-Royce bespoke by way of the canvas. At Rolls-Royce Coach Build, we break through that ceiling, embracing the freedom of expression afforded by coach building to shape a concept directly with our commissioning patrons. Boat Tail is a distinct counterpoint to industrialized luxury. The car has an exclusive sun visor, more expensive than many modern cars. It protects the occupants from the sun, for whom picnic chairs with a carbon fiber frame have been designed. Removable trays keep snacks at a comfortable height. As if this were not enough, the Swiss watchmaker Beauvais 1822 has created an exclusive watch for this boat tail. 
There's also a 15-speaker sound system that has been modified to use the car's platform as a sound box. What you see here in the back is probably technically the most refined picnic facility on Earth, said Torsten muller Otvas, CEO of Rolls-Royce Motor Cars. Another unique luxurious touch blends the pinnacle of automotive and clockmaking smart craftsmanship to keep time two reversible his and hers two-sided timepieces by Swiss-based Beauvais 1822, either one of which can be taken off the owner's wrist and mounted on the dashboard fascia as a clock while the other is stored in a special tray compartment. Rolls-Royce said of the three-year collaboration, the mechanically-minded clients sought to break new ground in horology as esteemed and passionate collectors of both the Swiss-based House of Beauvais and Rolls-Royce, their vision was to create exquisite, groundbreaking timepieces for their boat tail. The result is an accomplishment never before realized in either industry. Two fine reversible timepieces, one for the lady and one for the gentleman, have been designed to be worn on the wrist or placed front and center within boat tail's fascia as the motor car's clock. Historically, coach building had been an integral part of the Rolls-Royce story. The contemporary Rolls-Royce narrative has informed our guiding philosophy of bespoke. But it is so much more. Rolls-Royce coach build is a return to the very roots of our brand. It represents an opportunity for the select few to participate in the creation of utterly unique and truly personal commissions of future historical significance, Torsten muller Otvas, chief executive of Rolls-Royce added. Instrument dials are adorned with decorative gulachi patterning as perfected by fine jewelers and watchmakers and there's an elegant thin-rimmed two-tone steering wheel. A particularly cherished Mont Blanc pen resides in a discreetly placed handcrafted case of aluminum and leather in Boat Teal's glove box. Collecting pens is another of the client's great passions. Blemish-free leather in a favorite shade of blue with the light metallic sheen is sourced from hides of stress-free alpine cows in Bavaria. The exterior paint is a special shade of blue, the client's favorite color, with embedded metallic and crystal flakes to catch the light. Wooden trim in the lower cabin and floor area echoes a ship's hull and the hollow section of floor sill specially engineered to double as a resonance chamber to provide bass speaker surround sound for the 15-speaker audio system. Under the bonnet of the boat tail is Rolls-Royce's massive 6.7-liter V12 twin-turbocharged petrol engine developing around 570 horsepower and linked to an 8-speed automatic. The company will say only that performance is adequate, but based on that of the current Phantom, expect 0 to 62 miles per hour acceleration of around 5 seconds with top speed governed at 155 miles per hour. The idea is that owner will drive with it in place from, say, a home in rainy Britain, then remove it for open-top driving when at a chateau in sunny south of France or Monaco. Rolls-Royce explains, if inclement weather is encountered while the roof is removed, a temporary tonneau is stowed for static transitory shelter. Nautical-style wraparound windscreen recalls the visor on motor launches, while the styling and tapered rear is designed to mirror a motor launch rising out of the water. Are you interested in the specifications of this car? Which feature did you like the most? Let us know your opinion about this most expensive car in the comment section below. This was all for today. Hope you liked the video. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Hit the bell icon for more updates and notifications. Stay safe and we'll be back soon with another video.